The battle over abortion is back in the spotlight. A federal judge in Texas appointed by former President Trump heard arguments in a lawsuit that seeks to overturn the FDA's decades-old approval of a drug called Mifepristone. The pill is used in more than half of all abortions in the United States, and the case could force it to be pulled off the market nationwide. NBC senior legal correspondent Laura Jarrett joins us. Laura, let's start right there. I'm sure there are folks yeah. sitting at home and saying, no, wait a minute, how can one judge right. in Texas... In, have a ruling that would effectively yank a drug off the market nationwide. I think it's surprising to a lot of people, but this is how federal jurisdiction works. The idea being, if the FDA actually didn't follow the right process and it's illegal and it's not safe, then it's not safe anywhere uh, all across the country. Now, of course, the defense here, the Justice Department, is saying, look, we have studied this for over 20 years and the drug is exceedingly safe. Providers will tell you it is safer than Tylenol, but the judge yesterday in court seemed very receptive to this idea that somehow uh, it had been fast-tracked and they hadn't adequately evaluated the safety of it. That, that's the heart of the lawsuit, but let's go back to practical matters for a second. If, let's say, this judge were to strike this down and, yeah. and, and yank this drug off of shelves, what would be the immediate effect, likely? Well, right. So the practical effect is there is still another drug on the market, misoprostol, that allows you to terminate a pregnancy. It's used widely all over the world. However, providers will also tell you it has more side effects and it's not as effective if you use it alone without mifepristone. On the legal front, the Justice Department will immediately appeal this case. And so it's not the end of the road if the judge actually does what the plaintiff wants and issues this injunction, but no guarantee what the Court of Appeals would do and no guarantee what the Supreme Supreme Court would do if it ultimately got the case. And often when you have a legal challenge like that, you might, the, the Department of Justice would ask for a stay, saying, yes. Let, do nothing until we can resolve this legal matter in the higher court. Essentially courts. asking the Court of Appeals to put the judge's ruling on pause, allow the judge to proceed in circulation while the case continues. Any idea when the ruling could come? He said as soon as possible. Okay, Laura, thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.